Congratulations. Call the honourable member for Leichhardt. Thank you very much indeed, uh, Mr Deputy Speaker. In February 2012, this parliament recognised a terrible act of genocide. 7,000 men and boys were massacred in Bosnia, Bosnia in 1995 because of their Muslim faith. What if I told you that in India in 1984, more than five times that many, 37,000 predominantly men and young boys were massacred, and that more than 300,000 people were displaced or made homeless for a similar reason? And that, uh, and that since then, the persecution has continued to this day all because of their Sikh faith. I've spoken several times in this place about why these events of November 1984 took place. Today I rise to recognise an event that I took part in at the end of last year, the Sikh Genocide Remembrance March in Melbourne. On the 13th of December, I led around 1,000 Sikhs through the city centre to commemorate the 30th anniversary of this terrible time. It was an amazing experience to work in, walk in a sea of colourful turbans and saris and feel the emotion of the day. Back in 19, uh, 1944, Rafael uh, Limken coined the, the term genocide after seeing the horror of the Holocaust in Nazi-occupied Europe. It was a blight on human, uh, human, humankind that, uh, despite there now being a universal understanding of what genocide is, these atrocious acts have not stopped. Thirty years on, the physical wounds from the violence may have healed, but the damage inflicted on the psyche of a generation of Sikhs remains. I've been involved in this course for several years now, all thanks to my very good friend uh, Deljit Singh. On November 2012, I tabled a petition in the parliament with more than 4,500 signatures calling on Australia to recognise the event as an act of genocide. Unfortunately, it was ignored by the foreign minister in the previous government. I'd like to particularly acknowledge the, Sikh, uh, the Supreme Sikh Council of Australian representatives of the Sikh Genocide Recognition National Committee for their work in raising an in, in, uh, a, awareness about this issue. Deljit Singh, Gurjeet Singh, Harikarat Singh, uh, Gurbaz Singh, Gurmeet Singh, Jadurav Singh and Harpal Singh. As key international guests who also attended the march, I'd like to acknowledge Jagmeet Singh, MP, member of the uh, uh, Ontario Parliament in Canada, Jatna Singh and uh, Jakawant Singh, uh, Patnu Singh uh, for justice in the USA, and Harinder Singh, a Sikh Research Institute. I pledge my support to continue working to achieve, in achieving recognition for the Sikh genocide in the Australian Parliament, and I would certainly urge the Australian Parliament to uh, recognise this horrible event, because until such time, we, we can't change the past, Mr Deputy Speaker, but what we can do, we can recognise these acts for what they really are, and I think that's all very, very important in bringing closure and recognition for this wonderful, uh, wonderful group of Australians uh, that we have in, as part of our community. Thank you.